Hey, I'm Brandon with Revzilla, joined here by my buddy Pat. We are checking out the Bullet Zero skinny jeans available at Revzilla.com. So the zero skinny jeans, as you can tell, these are a bit fitted to the body. Pat doesn't usually go for this style. I think he looks cute as a button. These are gonna be a great option if you have slim legs or you just like this overall style. But of course, this is gonna give you a bit more protection in comparison to a set of non-riding jeans. And this is a single layer, and you're gonna have that Kovec material incorporated here. It's about 84% cotton, 13% Kovec, and about 3% elastane. So there's a lot of stretch incorporated with these particular jeans. So Moving around on the bike and just being comfortable, even if you're on a bit more of an aggressive bike uh, like an R6 or something like a Cafe Racer that puts you uh, tightly in the tank there, these are very comfortable to wear. That stretch does make a huge difference there. Now let's talk about the overall fit. Pat here is about 220 pounds, six feet tall, and typically bounces around between a size 34 and a size 36. He's currently wearing a size 34 in these jeans, and they actually fit him well, and they fit him well in the waist, and he's got some room to spare there because of all the stretch, so it is accommodating but I will say, if you are gonna throw in the armor, I would recommend going up to the next size, especially in the hip area. So if Pat was gonna throw in all the armor, uh, the armor is not included with these jeans, but if he wanted to update that, he would bounce up to the next size, which would be the 36 for him. So just something to keep in mind. If you are gonna wear these and you do plan on putting in the armor, which I think most people going for this style probably won't be adding the armor in the hips, but if you do, go up to the next size and you should be all set. Now keep in mind, these will ship to you for free. They're coming in around $140. And as always, we do have a price match policy in place that is there to ensure that you're getting the best deal around. Now, if you wanted to step it up, you could check out the Covert Evo Slim. Those aren't quite as fitted to the body. They're about $170, but they get a CE AAA rating, whereas these are only getting a CE AA rating when it comes to the abrasion resistance. Now, there is something I wanted to mention about that. There's a bit of a caveat there. So the materials that they're using for these jeans are CE double A rated. However, in order to get that CE double A certification, you have to have the armor in the jeans. Now you might find the CE double A tag on here, but again, if you need that certification, if you're a stickler for that, you'll see that tag on the inside, but because the armor's not included, it will not technically meet that certification. So a bit odd there, Bullet, if you're watching this, just give us the armor. That would be great to have included with these jeans. But overall, I like the styling. It's very straightforward. We don't have a lot of brands or logos or anything flashy like that. If I didn't tell you these were Moto jeans, you probably wouldn't know that. And that's the biggest benefit and something I look for in a lot of my riding jeans. We do have some light stitching here just to hold those armor pockets in place. So if you want to add the armor, you can easily do so. But because it's a single layer, they have to stitch that on the outside. They can't just put it in on a liner or something that's on the inside there. So that's why you're seeing that little stitching accent there. I think it's well hidden, but it is something there that I don't absolutely love personally, but not a deal breaker for sure. Pat, go ahead and face the, the side for me, sir. Let's take a look here. Very straightforward on the side, no reflectivity is incorporated. Sometimes when you roll the cuff, you'll get a little touch of reflective. Sometimes they'll have a little patch at the top. Nothing like that, no crazy accents on the back of the seat of these pants. Pat, go ahead and face the back for me, sir. Let's get a quick look there. So very straightforward when it comes to the jean. And again, this is a single layer, so we don't have Kovec layer on the inside, which you will find on the Covert Evo Slims. But the benefit there is these aren't gonna get quite as warm as something like the Covert Evo Slims. You know, those are gonna be a little bit better suited for the cooler riding months. And I think you can easily get away and comfortably get away with these in the summer riding months because they don't have that bulky layer on the inside. Pat, go ahead and face the front for me, sir. Of course, if you're looking for more details, you can always click that info button. That's gonna take you over to revzilla.com where you can read other rider reviews. And if you have any questions about these riding jeans, jeans or any other gear you might be looking at, please don't hesitate to reach out. Give our gear geeks a call at 877-792-9455 or simply shoot over an email cs at revzilla.com. Thanks for hanging out with Pat and I and taking a closer look at the Bullet Zero skinny jeans. I'm Brandon. Keep it pinned.